Hi everyone, Anna Andrews Humbly here this Christmas Eve, this Illuminati Christmas Eve night. Um, just wanted to do a quick shout out to everyone. So check out your Illuminati calendars and you're going to find out that the Illuminati agendas are embedded and uh, encrypted into all these calendars to push forward the 1% parasitical elite Illuminati ones, their agendas. So let's just look at December 2017, just for a moment, if you don't mind. So we have National, well, hold on, first day of Advent, that's what I want to say first, then National Pearl Harbor Day, okay, November, or December 7th, okay, then first day of Hanukkah is in December, and then last day of Hanukkah is in December, first day of winter, um, you don't see... Winter solstice here. Christmas Eve is here, the 24th, which is today. And then all of a sudden we go into boxing. We go into the Illuminati sports arenas, okay? Boxing. Like, we really need boxing, you know, around the Prince of Pieces. And it's right after the Prince of Pieces uh, birthdays, too. Um, so, Kwanzaa, okay, until January 1st. So, but if you check out the Illuminati calendars, guys, you're going to find out all the embedded and um, hidden agendas. And they have them for us all because they're booting and looting the planet, okay? Booting and looting the planet and have been from local to global for how long now? For how long? So, and I'm telling you folks, if the Illuminati ones were up to good, then why, what's going on with uh, Hannah Montana and Miley, Miley Cyrus? Britney Spears. I mean, there's just so many people that they use. They use, abuse, excuse, and exploit their talents and their trades and their gifts. Okay, so for example, let's talk about Tiger Woods. Let's talk about um, uh, Kanye West. What did they do? What did they do to Kanye? Actually, they got him up there at the top, and then all of a sudden took him in for some. Uh, I don't want to call it tasing at the hospitals, but they call it MK Ultra. If you look at that video with Trump and uh, Kanye West, you'll see when he's coming out of Trump Towers, you'll see that uh, he was not himself. And then right now, currently, what's going on with Tiger Woods? Okay? Tiger Woods is having some issues, but he's not having those issues just because he's having those issues. He's having them because the Illuminati bad boys have used, abused, uh, used and abused not only Tiger Woods, but also exploiting the rest of the people on the planet. Okay? So that's what's going on. And those guys, those bad boys, need to be exposed. So don't fall into the hidden Illuminati trap, okay, of uh, feeling all stressed out, okay? Get yourself some stress relief, okay? Stress relief because from local to global, it's been a rich man's trick. People, what I want to say is these calendars are thick. These calendars are thick with the Illuminati hidden tricks they, to remind us. And then when they remind us each month, we run out and we spend the cash, you know, and buy the Illuminati products and the hidden agendas. So, but what we need to get back to is our sacred family tree roots and to remember where we came from, you know, and to, to practice those traditions, you know. I mean, my mom was Polish. My mother loved making ceramic trees, by the way. So this is why I have this here. It reminds me of my mother. And so that's why I do this. So, I mean, nothing wrong with incorporating your values and your beliefs and your traditions, but really and truly people... The Illuminati uh, holidays, if you will, they're not our family values and traditions, if you, if you think about it. If you think about our original roots, our indigenous roots, and where we came from, you know, from Sacred Mother Earth, from Sacred Grandma um, here. This is my other half, Carrie Joy Dinette and her grandma Susanna Dinette, who chose to stay with us. Um, <coughs> it was during the Illuminati Christmas holiday season, but Grandma came to sit, stay with Carrie and I in Flagstaff, Arizona, um, at our home. She wanted to stay with us at a sacred time, which was prayer feather time. So she chose to stay with us. Um, and that is so powerful, spiritually speaking, and I'm so grateful eternally for that. And I don't uh, belittle that for no time or uh, at all from past to present. And what I want to say too, though, is, you know, on my dad's side of the family, because I said my mom was Polish, right? So mom, mom's Polish. I know that there's old cultural, um, how do I say this, traditions and habits and, and uh, values and beliefs that the Polish people had. And I want to know what those were. You know, I want to know what my indigenous roots were like. So, and then also Arawak from my father, which is the tribe that Christopher Columbus supposedly conquered. 
Christopher Columbus didn't conquer the Arawak tribes. You know, the Illuminati once set sail, and, you know, I was thinking about this this morning. When they sent out the, the ships to uh, come and invade the indigenous lands, uh, even they say, they say to this day, aye, aye, Captain, aye, aye. Aye, aye, reminds me of the all-seeing Illuminati eye, guys. So, you know, this Illuminati all-seeing eye has been around for a long time. Here's